Hey, Saul Carter here with Others Realty. Wanted to talk today about updating your documents. When you're in a short sale, there's the short sale package, which is bank statements, financial statement, pay stubs, taxes, all that stuff. Well, as we're going through the transaction, you know, we've gotten an offer, we've sent off the short sale package. The bank asked for updated documents. And I've actually had some clients recently who basically said, oh, well, how are things going? And I said, well, I've been waiting for documents for two weeks from you, and I send you an email every other day and you know, talk to you about it. Well, things get put on hold if you're asked for documents from the bank and you don't provide them. So um, it's important. One of the things that I actually have all of my sellers sign is a seller's expectation document, which outlines the short sale process and all the things that are required of them. And I take it seriously. I want them to be just as involved as I am uh, to get this done for them. You know, no matter how much you try to help somebody, if they aren't involved, it's not going to happen. And uh, basically, if there's been any short sales that I haven't gotten done, um, I can specifically point to sellers not being engaged in why that happened. So anyway, um, here's doing real estate the other way. <clears throat> if you do have documents you need to get to me, get them to me and we'll get your short sale done. So if you have other questions or anything else, please give me a ring uh, or fill out the getting started form here on the left-hand side, my left-hand side, your right, and uh, I'll talk to you soon. Thanks. Bye.